here giving a talk at Real World Enterprise REST API Design about uh, APIs and specifically you mentioned lightweight APIs. What do you mean by designing a lightweight API? Oh, it's what lightweight API is actually using the minimal tools to reach something that you that you uh, that you that you want really. And uh, it was a lightweight process and with lightweight tools, lightweight tooling, what I meant by lightweight. But of course, lightweight, the result also is going to be lightweight API. And uh, lightweight API for me is also just providing the minimal things. And uh, so no, no uh, over engineering. Don't bloat your uh, API with un unnecessary things. And uh, the only thing you have to do is actually uh, keep the doors open to evolution. You have to, to uh, structure, for example, your, your URLs uh, in a way that you can add afterwards resources in your um, resource tree if you have a tree-like API. And it is also um, uh, having your model, your type definition, your JSON types uh, open to, uh, to, be, to be extended afterwards. But not implement really directly the whole things, all the use cases that you could imagine, just focus on what you have to do now and keep the doors open. Is, it, is there a particular challenge with APIs when you're moving towards a microservice architecture because you have more points of communication between the different services? Yes, of course, when you when you transform an application that is monolithic into microservices, uh, your application could have uh, um, transactional aspects. So when you distribute your applica application, you usually don't have any more a transactional context where everything happens. So in this situation, uh, you have to design the APIs in a way that it has uh, a protocol that the sequence of things that happen between the microservices uh, is done in a in a way that is uh, actually uh, that that does not really simulate the transactional aspects, but that uh, resembles uh, in, to um, achieve a sequence of, of operation and have at the end something that is uh, consistent. Right. What's the key takeaway from your talk? What do you hope that people have learned? So the talk was about uh, tooling for uh, for API design, and I've, sh I've shown uh, quite uh, some, some some examples of uh, of our APIs. And for me, it's more about tooling that we have in many open source projects around in the in the area of uh, of uh, REST APIs, and you have to pick them to choose the ones that fits the needs. Again, the simple one, the minimal one that, that fulfills your needs, and you can combine them together to have something uh, interesting. And this is actually the the project uh, that we uh, that we open sourced recently, Apicana, that does that. Just a combination of simple tools to provide something meaningful and lightweight. Thank you.